guys welcome to a new vlog it smells amazing in here and we're about to tell you why we're about to show you what you doing I'm cooking tell us tell us what you're doing what you're making I'm making a um, different kind of goulash than what I grew up with what I grew up with when it came to goulash was like tomato juice uh, macaroni, uh, elbow, elbow macaroni, um, like, what else did he put in there? Vegetables and stuff. It was good, you know? Beans. He put beans in there too. And meat. But a long time ago, one Are of my exes. Are you talking about your dad, babe? Yeah, dad. <laughs> um, a long time ago, one of my exes was like, uh, I do goulash a different way. So this is how they did it. Fry your meat, you saute your vegetables. God, ooh, spaghetti sauce. Goulash. They added onions and stuff, but you know, I don't do that. What so. pasta are you using? Shells? Yeah. I want to make you goulash one day. Since you got to have your exes, why, why don't you have your current girlfriends? I can. You made me uh, something at your house one time. I can't remember what it was, but it was really good. It was some kind of spaghetti noodle with mushrooms and tomatoes and like, I don't, like a garlic. I don't remember, but yeah, I, th I think I know what you're talking about. But I want you to try my goulash. I know you'll like it. You've liked everything I've ever cooked for you. I'm not saying I wouldn't like it. Well, I'm gonna do it one day. Okay. You I'll love my it. chili. Yes, I do, and it's almost time. Almost time. <laughs> Fall is coming. It is. Now she's putting it all together and stirring away. Yum. So now what's the next steps, babe? You just gotta let the sauce warm up and then it's done. Simmer. Everything's cooked. Will. Yeah, maybe about five minutes. We always cook so much food. <laughs> we need to figure out how to like cook less, you know? Because when Becky made that soup, it made too much. Way too much. So this will be good leftovers. Yum. So I'm sorry if you hear the dishwasher, but okay, so I hate LaCroix. I think I've tried two flavors, hate them. But my friend is convinced, convinced that I will like the limoncello. So let's give it a go, a little taste test moment. Smells great, smells like I'm gonna love it. What? That's not bad, babe. Do you want to try it? Yeah. It tastes like lemon cake or it tastes like lemon and vanilla together. Something. It's not bad. It definitely has a sparkling water moment that I don't really care about. Flavor is good. These I will not be wasting. <laughs> That's different, right? <laughs> so overall, zero through 10. I'm gonna give it a seven. Straight up, I'm gonna give it a five. <laughs> because, because of that seltzer. Yeah, it's like that sparkling moment. You know? Yeah. yeah. I, I'll drink these though. I got it. But overall, the flavor, like the lemon, you're right, it's like lemon, vanilla, like pound cake or yeah. something. Yeah. I guess that's a limoncello. I don't know. I don't know. Hey guys, so I just woke up from a nap. I noticed that I do a lot of napping. It's because I don't get good sleep at night. I don't know. Lately it's just been a little a little weird sleeping for me. Something else I also noticed. Today's a third day where my breathing feels really like hard. Like it's hard for me to breathe. And I was like, what is going on? 
Last night, Becky went on her weather app and it says the air quality for some reason where we live is really bad and it's making people with already like breathing problems, it's making it to where it's hard for them to breathe. So I was like, that makes a lot of sense because I was like, what is going on? So my breathing's been like, not the greatest, if you will. So I'm actually about to be a little bit productive here. I have an actual mess. This doesn't happen, really. I like my stuff to be clean, but it's not, apparently. You know, I've let it go the last few days. It happens. This right here is actually what you guys um, sit on when I'm filming. It's a trash can we've never ever used and some books. Oh, and I've gotten some questions. People are like, why does she need PMS bombs if she had a hysterectomy? Um, I have a girlfriend. Those are hers. So, on the count of three, this will be clean. One, two, three. Now this is more like it. Yeah, yeah. Nice and clean. I use Method, a bathroom cleaner, Spearmint. I'm obsessed with the smell of this. I make sure to clean my bathroom every day, but the last few days, honestly, maybe a week, I kind of let it slip. Hey guys, so it is the next day. I'm currently just eating a salad real quick and getting ready. Becky and I are actually going to her nephew's birthday party. It's gonna be like at a park, lake situation type thing. Um, so this is a salad I am eating. It is a Asian salad. So good. It's actually one of these Eat Smart sesame thingies. It's vegetable salad blend, a cashew, sesame sticks, sweet sesame dressing. It's really good. And I also, before I leave, I think I'm going to paint my nails in Jealous Boyfriend 676. Such a pretty color. I feel like it would match good with my dress that I'm wearing. You guys, it feels incredible outside. Oh my god. And look at this cell phone case that Becky surprised me with. She also has a matching one. And so does her sister. So we're all matching, same color, same everything. I don't think I've ever had an otter box. So now I trust if that I ever drop my phone, we're safe. We are safe. I'm waiting for Becky. So we can get going. So we can get going. I don't know why, but I've been singing almost everything that I say. <laughs> I'm weird, y'all. And I did do my nails. So yeah. My dress says I'm bored. <laughs> it's cute, okay? Let's enjoy the Kentucky scenery. And our windshield is filth. We definitely need to see someone about that. <laughs> So we have arrived. It's actually so beautiful down here. We had his birthday party, I think a year ago or two years ago here as well. When was it, babe? Pretty sure it was last year. Yeah. There's a lake out there. You guys can kind of see it. 10 left, then arrive at your destination. Oh, for us, you're still on. <laughs> Look at the pretty lake. It's so nice. I think we're gonna set up over there. Look how pretty. Unless you don't want them. I want them. Huh? I want them. You taking pics? Yeah. Yeah. What? It would be awesome if this was in our backyard. Oh yeah. You guys, the weather is literally on fleek. On fleek. This is a horrible angle of me. My hair. I love you, babe. I love you too. <laughs> oh, we're actually getting ready to leave. The party was really fun, wasn't it? Yeah. It was feels so good. Now we're gonna um, meet up with Dana, Destiny, Hannah, Rafe. This water actually looks nice to swim in, don't it? 
versus the other part of the lake that we used to swim in. Mm -hmm. That's that's a yikes. But this looks actually really nice. Like, tell me you ain't jealous. Look. Beautiful. Hello, everyone. So it is actually the next day. Last night was super fun, hung out with some friends. Hanging out with some friends was like a very much a last minute thing, but it was really fun. So I'm actually about to cook myself first meal of the day. Kind of gonna be a feast of some sort. I'm gonna have eggs. I'm gonna have some turkey sausage links, hash browns, bell pepper, some pepper jack cheese, some watermelon. So, Let's do this thing. First things first, I'm gonna cut me a bell pepper. The seeds in it kind of freak me out, but you know, it's worth it. Like look how creepy that looks. No. The spray I will be using is avocado oil. Let that heat up and then put my bell pepper and this is where I'm going to be um, cooking my hash browns as well. I'm going to make my turkey sausage in this one and then my eggs in that one. So my hash browns and bell pepper are going and they're pretty much done. So I added a slice of pepper jack cheese to it. My one egg. I made two sausages. And yeah, Becky's actually having a salad with my leftover bell pepper because I only used half. And she's using this balsamic calorie free dressing and some romaine leaf. This is the best way to have salads in my opinion, is using that instead of like the pre-packaged lettuce. My food is complete. So on my egg, we just have some everything but the bagel sesame seasoning. On the hash browns, I added some black pepper, some garlic salt, onion powder, and minced onion. Might add some cholulu, some cholula, I mean, because I do like it spicy, so yum. Do you guys like my scrunchie? This color is everything. I'm about to have me some watermelon. Mm. Girl. Watermelon sugar pow. Watermelon sugar pie. You guys hear Becky? She just started singing Watermelon Sugar High. She does not like music like that, but everyone knows that song. Mm. I don't mind that song. Oh, you like it? You like this I don't song? like it and have to download it or anything, but I don't mind it. Yeah. I personally love him, so. I used to hate watermelon, which is so weird. Mm. Because it's so good, I don't understand. And we have ourselves a sausage moment. Ooh, those are good. Mm. Little egg, bell pepper, and hash brown moment. And I did end up putting hot sauce because. <laughs> Um, <laughs> so I'm not much of a let's decorate for Halloween type of person. Becky is. So we decided, you know what? Let's do the thing. So I wanted to show you the stuff that I picked out majority. Becky picked out a few things, but I'm going to show you the stuff we got to decorate our home for Halloween this year. I'm actually pretty excited because it is some cute stuff. Ooh, that's loud. So we got this scary haunted house. I thought it was actually really cute. This black pumpkin with roses. And it's a lot heavier than it looks. Got this sign that says happy haunting. I think that's so pretty. Something about it. Look at this doggo. <laughs> This is so cute. And he's holding a pumpkin. 
I might put a few pieces of candy in there. Oh shoot, is there a light? Oh, sis, I didn't even see that, okay. And then I know in a recent vlog, I said that the skeleton stuff is kind of weird, but I saw a couple skeleton things that I actually love. This is an octopus. <laughs> I love it so much, it's so cute. And then a skeleton unicorn. I'm here for it if you are, even if you're not. This is just decoration, there's nothing in it. It says witch's brew, cute little witch hat on top. And then obviously we needed the witch's brew book, poison apple. So that's what it looks like. I love it so much. And then the super cute skeleton with a rose in his mouth. Oh my God, I'm obsessed. So that's everything actually I picked out. And then Becky, <laughs> I freaking love her. I love her so much, you don't even know. We do have some dishes to do, so don't mind that. She picked out this gal and this fella, love, but what? Okay, so <laughs> creepy, hi. I guess that's what Halloween is about, but listen, you guys. Listen to the scariness. You need to smile more, or I can carve one in for you from ear to ear. What, like, um, what? Tell me more. He only works when he wants to. When did all the children run off to? Oh boy. Creepiest thing I've ever seen. Mm, creepiest thing I've ever seen. So a little update for the day. I haven't really vlogged. I've honestly just been cleaning, not doing much. Watched my friend on live because she sells jewelry. So I bought some of that. So I was at Walmart last night and you guys, look at these cute, Freaking shoes. I got these for um, Becky's niece. She's only a couple months old and she's freaking adorable. I took some pictures with her yesterday um, at the birthday party. So I'm gonna show you the few photos actually from the party. Becky and I, she took that on her phone. Me and her, I don't wanna say her name, but there she is. Then Becky's like, I want to take pictures of you in front of the lake. <laughs> so I'm laughing. And then there's that one. There's also a couple more, but these two were the best for sure. So we're actually about to go for a walk. It's a little chilly out there. You don't want to get you a cardigan. Is it? What's the temperature? <sighs> 57. So it's not bad, but it's not like, you know, warm. I guess I can find a little, uh -uh, a little small Cardi, Cardi B. <laughs> Let's see. I'll just wear this. Keep it nice and simple. We're gonna take Twinkie. My goal. Um, I'm not doing. Sorry, I didn't know you were filming. Are you dancing, babe? <laughs> You're so cute. So my goal, because last time I walked 0.27 of a mile, today I want to do 0 0.03. Zero. Oh. Wait, what? What? Zero, three, zero. <laughs> Say 0.30. So almost a third, mm -hmm. but it's not. Right. Because 0.33. Three. Or a third. What if you just, just this once, don't pay attention to how far you walk and see how far you can walk? Yeah, because I was paying a lot of attention last time. Mm -hmm. That's a good idea. This girl right here, she keeps me on my tippy toes. I try. And you smart. Smart. Is that someone's dog poop? You've got to be kidding. <gasps> it is. What? 
That's someone's dog poop. Should we pick it up? No. No? Nope. We only brought one bag, huh? Yep. All right, let's go. So we walked for 13 minutes and I went 0.31. So I was gonna do what Becky said and just walk till I was done. But at that point I was only at 0 0.20. So I just kept pushing forward and went to my goal. It felt so good outside. It felt so good that when we came in here, it felt hot, even though it's not hot in here, it's like 68 degrees. Twinkie gets a walk every single day. It's usually Becky who takes her. I'm sure it was nice to have her mama both her mamas out there with her. It was fun. I definitely need to do it more often and that's the point that I'm trying to make. So I'm gonna end the vlog here. It's time for the curvy comment. And I use commentpicker.com and whatever one it lands on is the one that I read no matter what it says. I have some toothpaste right here. So that's like an awkward moment. I brushed my teeth before we went on the walk. I just brushed my teeth randomly, so. so the curvy comment winner is a purple dragon lady. She said, don't you know how to buy a stool to step on and get in the bed? That simple. Salt causes swelling. Your videos are the same thing every time. There is one and boring. Thank you for your opinion. So there's three things to talk about here. Um, buying a stool to step on the bed. I'm able to get on the bed without a stool, so I don't need a stool. Salt causes swelling. Yes, it does. A lot of sodium causes swelling, especially when you have lymphedema. I'm holding on to a lot of fluid right now. It's just something I'm struggling with. Your videos are the same thing every time there is there is one and it's boring. So if you're bored, I think you should move on and find another YouTuber. There's plenty you can watch and I'm not even saying that in like a condescending or mean way. I legitimately don't know why people would watch anyone that they're bored by because I know for a fact I wouldn't. I watch a lot of vloggers and their life is a lot like mine. You know, it's just repetitive, everyday, normal living. I don't live my life for the vlog. I just simply vlog my life and there's a huge difference. If you wanna find a vlogger who is living their life to vlog, then I'm not the one. Um, there are a few on there who are extra on their videos just for the vlog, but that's not me. I'm just gonna sit here and show my life. And if you don't enjoy it, then don't watch. I personally prefer the vlogs that are like mine. Very just mundane, you know, hang out with your friends here and there, go shopping, show me what you eat, what are you doing around the house? Like those are just chill vlogs and that's kind of what I go for because that's my life. So anyways, I hope that you guys enjoyed this vlog and I will see you in my next one, bye.